This game has less mini games, which I also consider to be good. Although I kind of miss them in the end. The ones from 7 were badass where you could be on the motorcycle and shit. You're not going to see that kind of shit happen in this. There's no card games, no collecting of strange shit to fucking do. There's no fucking submarines or fucking... It, there's nothing. No chocobo racing. You just, just no fucking slot machines. You're not getting mini games. If you like the fucking mini games, kiss them goodbye. This is both good and bad, depending if you like the fucking mini games. I always thought they didn't hurt anything. Fucking put the mini games in there. It didn't hurt. Could be cool. Could be dumb. You could always skip them. So fuck that. Anyway, there are no mini games. The last fucking reason this game is good. This giant hulking fucking red beast is out there stomping the countryside, making everybody piss their goddamn pants in the entire world for no fucking reason whatsoever. It is a motherfucking falsy of life, and it eats elephants for lunch. As you can fucking see here, this fucking clip of him eating a motherfucking elephant for lunch. So, that's why the game is good. If that's not enough for you to fucking play the game, then fucking stop right there. Don't fucking buy it. Just go home and get some beer and do something else with your fucking money. If that's not enough for you. If that's enough for you, then it's fucking enough. Don't say it, fucking tell you what's good. That's it. If you can think of something else that's really good about this game, feel free to fucking add to the more fucking comments. Now what's fucking bad about this game? Excuse me while I bitch about the fate of this motherfucking series. I'm sorry. The ball has been more than dropped. The ball was fucking launched into orbit and we cannot get the ball back. The Final Fantasy series is seriously taking a fucking dive like fucking Greg Luganis did. We broke his motherfucking neck and furthermore did not enter Olympic diving competitions. You bitch, it's really fucking bad. Let me explain why. I'm not fucking kidding. This is fucking bullshit. Bullshit, people. This game could have been so good. This is amounting to sheer laziness on the parts of the motherfucking programmers as to why this game sucks horse shit. Seriously, pure laziness. All down to the motherfucking programmers. There is no forgiveness for this shit. I have none. I will take a dump in a square executive's fucking mouth for doing this to my motherfucking beloved series. Leave it at fucking 10, you bitches. Why'd you have to do this? Son of a bitch. Here's the fucking reasons this game sucks my dick. For half of the motherfucking game, half. So, in my case, so far, 30 hours. I'm expecting to clock in 60 hours. The first 30 hours of this motherfucking game was a straight fucking line. I mean, why turn on the map? Don't turn on the map. You don't need the motherfucking map. It's in the way. There's no turns, no twists, no forks. There's nothing but a motherfucking straight line to follow. From the motherfucking beginning of the game to the halfway point of the game. You can't even fucking miss a treasure chest on the motherfucking way from the front of the game to the halfway point of the motherfucking game. And I'm, I'm fucking stretching that halfway point thing. This could be like three-fourths point here. I could safely say the three-fourths of the game is spent going in a singular straight fucking line with no motherfucking town. I'm serious. No fucking towns. With no functioning buildings or interactions with people to do such things as exchange items, modify items, etc. I'm serious. This boils down to sheer laziness. The fact that an entire fucking colony of 12 million people could be sitting there up on the motherfucking moon and you manage to see a whole fucking 40 of them all of whom are bitching about the fact they're getting shot is seriously fucked up. I am not exaggerating people. 
This is seriously the way the first part of the game goes. If you can't handle fucking going from front to back, basically fight, watch a movie, 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 fight, watch a motherfucking movie, rinse, repeat, do it a thousand more times. It's annoying that I repeat it. Imagine what it's like playing a goddamn thing. If you can't fucking handle that, then don't buy the goddamn game. You heard it from me first. You're not gonna hear it from the motherfucking Game Informer magazine, because Square already paid them off. You're gonna just see them suck their dick, is what you're gonna do when they fucking come out with their review of this shit in a couple months. All it's gonna be is a bunch of cock sucking. Trust me, I know. But, straight line to the halfway point. Not good. Not fucking good. No finding of treasures or exploration. Not good. Not fucking good. Very, very boring. The plot is interesting to watch. And that saves you from fucking dying on the way. But, they could have just as well played a three hour fucking movie and started you at the halfway point and do all the shit they did. It's pretty fucking meaningless.